The main objective or the main goal of the project was to recruit, train, deploy an eight-person crew of young emerging forestry professionals to hand thin over 100 acres of ponderosa pine and mixed conifer forests in the Dry Lake Hills area of Coconino National Forest. The partnership is between American Conservation Experience, Flagstaff Watershed Protection Project, City of Flagstaff, U.S. Forest Service, and of course the National Forest Foundation. So I guess the background of this project goes back all the way to the mid-90s and there were a lot of partner groups around Flagstaff that came together because they realized that high severity wildfire was a big problem for Flagstaff. And so that really is sort of the foundation or the starting point for FWPP. This project is really important for the community of Flagstaff. This project really exemplifies how different organizations are utilizing their strengths to come together in order to protect our community from catastrophic forest fires as well as post-fire flood impacts. This is one of the most important projects for the community that I've worked on um, because there is such a direct relationship between what happens here and the impact on the city, on the community itself. If this area was to burn at high intensity, we would be very likely to see um, post-fire flooding. And so it would be much like what we saw with Schultz, except there are even more values downstream to be impacted. You know, there's, uh, we've got the hospital, we've got City Hall, we've got the railroad tracks, you know, NAU campus. All of those could potentially be affected by flooding that would happen if this area burned at a high intensity. And so the work we're doing here is to try to get ahead of that, um, to try to uh, prevent that from happening, and also restore more natural conditions here. It's a very popular recreation area. It's right behind a lot of neighborhoods. We want it to continue to be a beautiful place that people can enjoy. The Flagstaff Watershed Protection Project is a huge project for the community of Flagstaff. It's focusing on two of the key watersheds for the community of Flagstaff, the Rio de Flag, as well as the Lake, Upper Lake Mary watershed. And both of those watersheds are key for different reasons, that whether they're providing drinking water, or they're providing a healthy ecosystem, or maybe they're just providing a resource where there's it's storing water so that when we do have major rains, there's a place for that water to go versus flooding down into the community of Flagstaff. Basically what we're doing is making sure there's no ladder fuels so that there aren't crown fires where all these giant old trees are just just lighting up like a tinderbox and then once all that growth is dead it leaves the soil just like completely loose and unprotected so when monsoon season comes uh, it's gonna be a lot of flooding and they experienced that with the Schultz fire, I know, um, back in 2010. And so we're here to make sure nothing like that happens again. And Flagstaff keeps being like a vibrant urban wildland interface. First of all, I've really, really honed in on my saw skills. Um, it's been, it's been huge, like to be able to work in partnership with the Forest Service, running a chainsaw every single day. It's also been great to be working in the local community. A lot of the work that we do throughout ACE takes us all over Arizona and the surrounding states and uh, I don't have much of an opportunity to work here in town, which is the original reason that I came out here. Definitely made me more passionate about conservation work, that's for sure. I think that that's had a huge impact on me. and being in a very different environment um, and then just <laughs> the physical part of it too like I know I've definitely gotten stronger and I've gotten oh, mentally and physically stronger because you have to be able to be mentally aware to be to be using a chainsaw as much as we do <laughs> and so I think that that's it's made me a stronger person I think. Coming out here the landscape's so much different than out east. Uh, it makes, I just kind of fell in love with it. Uh, I want people to be able to come out here and enjoy what they have. It'd be a huge shame if people couldn't just come out and get away from the city. Being out here and checking on the ACE crew periodically, I've been really impressed with how enthusiastic they are and how excited they are to be out here and how knowledgeable they are of the woods and, and the, the forest ecology out here. And it's been, um, it's been definitely a credit to FWPP and our project to have them on board and to have them out here working and engaging with the public that they see out on the trails. And that's been, that's been very helpful for us.
On behalf of American Conservation Experience, we would like to thank the National Forest Foundation as well as the Flagstaff Watershed Protection Project for giving us this opportunity to do really important work for the community of Flagstaff.